Hi, welcome again to our channel with me Wahyu or you can simply call me Sam Today we will make an instrument box like the one you see on the screen right now And to do that, you'll have to open the Design Spark mechanical software and we will start with File New Design First, we will make the basic rectangle shape so click here rectangle and then we will make the rectangle 80 millimeters length and press tab 60 millimeters wide okay click select click home now we will add walls around this uh, shape and we'll be using the wall thickness 3.2 in this case I'm using 0.4 millimeter nozzle so it's advisable to make the walls as the multiplication of the nozzle diameter in this case I'm multiplying by 8 for the thickness so 0 0.4 times 8 is 3.2 let's uh, add another rectangle here then with uh, the white will be 3.2 and then also at this side okay but wait it should be 60 millimeters okay also this side Okay, uh, press tab 3.2 also same for this one 3.2 yes okay we already have uh, the basic sketch for the walls here we will need to make slot for the bolt so in this example I'm using four bolts right here okay one two three four and then uh, this will be the slot where the bolt will uh, goes in to the body of the box so we will draw here and for the slot thickness it's also advisable to use multiplication of the nozzle diameter so in this case I'm going to use again 3.2 3.2 plus 3.2 plus 3 millimeters the diameter of the bolt so it will be 9.4 we will make a circle with 9.4 millimeters diameter so to do that you can use this uh, three-point circle or in this case I'm going to use the more basic method so 9.4 here and 9.4 here and then we will make this lines okay so yes that will be the center point click here and it is 9.4 so next we are going to make the similar circle here but I'm going to use a different method so in this case 9.4 divided by 2 is 4.7 so here I have 4.7 by 4.7 and this will be the center for the circle 9.4 okay and then for this one let me try using the three point circle so I'm going to click here and then here and okay so I'll input here 9.4 okay and for the last one I'll use the same method here 9.4 type in 9.4 okay press select that's it yes now we have the basic shape for the box next we will convert this shape to become a 3d model so in order to do that we click this one the 3d mode okay and then after that we will pull the outer walls and also the bolt slot so press control on your keyboard and click on the area that you would need to uh, extrude or pull okay and then after that we will click this one pull and then drag in this case I'm going to use 40 millimeters okay done 
now for the base um, we will make the thickness by three millimeters so you can click here but don't forget this one if you use the same method and then pull three millimeters okay next we will make the hole for the ball to goes in so click on this surface and then click this one the circle okay now we will add the holes for the bolts click here and then type in three because I'm going to use three millimeters bolt this one also three millimeters yes next uh, click the 3d mode okay and then we will click here and here so press control and click on the uh, small circles and then click pull and we will extrude cut in this case I'm going to input 15 millimeters okay press oh, done this will be the base or the body of the box now we will make the cover of the box click here and then press ctrl C and then press ctrl V and then move uh, by maybe 10 millimeters okay so this will be the basic reference for the cover click here double click okay it will select all these edges on the inside and then click this one fill it will delete the uh, hole or simplify the shape and then click you can click pull here and let's make the thickness by three millimeters done we already have the cover now and maybe you want to add some chamfer so click here and then press pull then click here the chamfer I'll put one millimeters okay here also press home done this will be the basic shape for the box we will add hole here so just click on this surface and then click this one the circle okay and then we'll move the view a little so it's easier to work on that surface and then click here I'll make 12 millimeters diameter okay and then click this one the 3d mode click here on the surface of the circle and then we will you can click this cut or just uh, pull or drag or extrude right away okay now we have one hole right here and then if you want to add another hole maybe at the cover you can also click here okay and then this one sketch mode and then just add the shape that you want so maybe for this example I'll add one small hole right here maybe for a LED or indicator lamp maybe three millimeters uh, maybe that's too small four millimeters okay and then let me add another maybe some square here so let me add 8 by 8 okay and then click here select click 3d mode and then click on the surface that you want to extrude as hole so click pull and then extrude this one also same method done so this will be the basic shape of the box but if you want to add some more feature inside so for example let me hide the cover okay the moment let me rename this one let me hide the cover so if you want to add maybe a mounting for both that you will put the PCB or the circuit board in you can also add like this as maybe a circle with let's say 9.5 diameter okay and then 
this one is 3 mm okay click the 3d view click this uh, donut ring and then pull maybe 10 millimeters okay so now you have uh, mounting for the PCB screw maybe you want to add two or three or four up to you congratulations now you can design your own instrument box with your own specification for the dimension size and maybe you can also uh, add whole sports as you like anyway if you have suggestions please put in the comment below and don't forget to subscribe i'll see you again in the next video bye